Hello and welcome to the second video of today. So I am now about to create the new sim that I said in the previous video and the video before that. So I know that Sharon already guessed who I was going to go with and she had guessed correctly. I wanted to create the Doctor from Doctor Who. But the thing is there's a bit of a tricky one to like make because obviously there's 13 incarnations of the Doctor so it's like one of them things where you have to like obviously you can't get the whole costume, the outfit or the look down to a T because we're limited to so much stuff in this game so I decided to make a Doctor that was basically like had sort of like David Tennant hairstyle-ish not 100% accurate as you can see here right now this is the hairstyle I'm gonna go with but even down to the outfit like the outfit isn't something that David Tennant's doctor would have worn it would have been like a, let's say from the classic series or maybe even Peter Capaldi like, I would say it was more like fused in between William Hartnell and Patrick Troughton. So, I'm just going through looks and stuff at the moment, just trying to see like... It's a bit of a difficult one, because originally I actually wanted to create Jodie Whittaker. But then I wanted, like, if I wanted Jodie Whittaker, then I'd want like suits and braces and all sorts. But the thing is, you can't get that for a female sim on the Sims Mobile. So hopefully in the future, can we have some suits please? Or some shirts and whatnot for female Sims please. Really need that. <laughs> so yeah, as I said, like I went with a David Tennant sort of hairstyle. And I don't know, maybe I was just creating my interpretation of the Doctor. So... Let's change the ears, make them a bit smaller. Because come on, who likes big ears? So this isn't going to do for the Doctor. Maybe for Christopher Eccleston-ish. Not for this one. So I'm just... The thing is, I, I'm looking through and... There's nothing that screams... Doctor. But do, do you get what I mean? Like... There's just nothing. So, naturally, I'm going to go with a full body outfit. This one's a bit too eccentric. I'm not going to use this one. Don't get me wrong, I do like that outfit. But I'm going to I'm gonna stick with this sort of like outfit. So I'm just going to go through all the colours and see which one stands out for this sim in question. So I think this is definitely going to be the Doctor's outfit. Can you imagine him running around and saving the planet with this outfit? Come on. And then I'm going to give him some canvas shoes, which in fact David Tennant's actually got in Doctor Who. So, I'm going to give him some glasses, because obviously he likes to wear his glasses occasionally. So yeah, it's not exactly like 100% like sim self of the Doctor because obviously where the Doctor's had 13 different incarnations but when I was creating this sim like there's certain aspects of like different Doctors in this sim for me So we're gonna start the life with the Doctor So let's do this, let's create the sim, let's get into it just took a screenshot so I can add it as my thumbnail. So I'm a bit lazy. Just chuck a few logos on. <laughs> so which trait should I choose for the Doctor? So... Oh. Okay, I think I'm going to go with outgoing free. Because he is pretty outgoing. He likes to put himself out there. Like, 
or he, she, whatever. Like. So, quest for love. How is everyone getting on with that? Come on. That reminds me, we need to find a doctor a job. So let's head over to Market Square because there's only one job that I can actually think that he might actually like. So let's go and give him the mysterious benefactor. So as everyone knows, the surgeon career. So quite fitting for a doctor really. But as I'm currently earning simoleons for my step in the quest for love, he needs a job. And I need to earn them simoleons if I want to get this head start this Valentine's Day quest. So yeah, let me know in the comments whereabouts you are on the quest for love. I hope you enjoyed the Create Zim video. Let me know your comments and I'll join you in the next video. Thank you.